Hey, in this quick After Effects tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create this bouncy text animation in Adobe After Effects. So let's start. So here we are instead of Adobe After Effects and now let's begin. So I'm going to click on new composition and then I'm going to set the width and height on 1080. I'm going to call it main and the duration is 50 seconds, which is too long. I'm going to change it to five seconds. All right, so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to first turn off the transparency so we can see the background. I'm going to create a new solid layer and we, call it, uh, and we are going to call it background. And then what we are going to do is that I'm going to go towards the text tool and I'm going to create my text. So let's call it bounce and let's align it towards middle and let's reduce its scale all right so the first thing i'm going to do is that i'm going to create a scale animation for the text so to do that i'm going to navigate through the text in animate menu i'm going to add a scale for it now as you see i have an animator one in here which consists of an scale and it's range selector one by navigating through the range selector one, we can change the appearance of the world. But right now, if I change it, nothing will happen because the scale is set on 100. So I'm going to set the scale on zero and then I'm gonna use either, you can use either start end or offset value, but I'm gonna set a keyframe on offset and exactly on 60 frames, I'm gonna change the offset to 100. Now we have an animation like this. As you see, the animation looks linear. So I'm gonna press F9 to apply standard easings to the keyframes. And then I'm gonna press Shift plus F3 to go towards the graph editor. Now I'm gonna change the graph to speed because it can work in speed better. And all right, so here's the basic animation that we have in here. Now it is time to add the bounce effect into it. Well, to add a bounce effect is pretty simple. All you need to do is that you need to add this expression uh, into your animation. Now I will put the expression link along with the project file in my Telegram channel. You can check the link in the description. So right now what I'm going to do is that I'm gonna select the add menu in add menu i'm gonna go towards the selector and i'm gonna add an expression so right now if i add an expression well nothing will happen now i'm gonna go towards the amount and then i'm gonna hold alt to open up the expression controller in here and then i'm gonna paste the expression so now if you want to tweak the bounce expression you can do that by changing the frequency amplitude or the decay parameter so as you see as i change each parameter i get a different result and then what i'm going to do is that i'm gonna duplicate this layer i'm gonna change its color And then I'm going to just push them towards right to create a focus movement. And lastly, I will just offset them quickly. So here we are at the end of this video and I hope you have enjoyed it. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button as it helps me out a lot for the future content. Thank you so much. I see you in the next video. Goodbye.